the ideal student for the Bowdoin Music Festival that would thrive in this atmosphere is one who is looking for a, an intensive place to make maximum musical growth, but we feel also one where they can grow as a person, as, as a human being. We try to create an atmosphere here that is um, free, that is nurturing, that is flexible, that allows students and faculty to come here with their own goals and to accomplish them. So there is the structure of a really well-run festival in a beautiful place. At the same time, within that structure, there is artistic freedom. We want Bowdoin to be a place of absolute musical excellence and the highest kind of creative ambition. So. Um, anyone who is, first of all, a first-class instrumentalist, this way too, <laughs> this way too, <laughs> this way too, um, is, it, it, that, that will help them enjoy Bowdoin that much more. To get the most out of chamber music, it requires also a sort of a, 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 sort of a mental flexibility, a curiosity, a, a need almost, not just a desire, but a need to learn from what's going on around you. Uh, because that's how you play chamber music, because you learn what's, what's happening around you. When faculty come here, they uh, not only are able to contribute in terms of the incredible performances that we have here, but they are busy during the rest of the day giving their students one, two, three, or more lessons each week out of their own uh, excitement for being here and having the freedom and time to, to create musically. Just a variety of experiences that we've had to be in touch with faculty that we normally wouldn't be able to be in touch with during the school year um, has been really instrumental in our development. We have an atmosphere where we're all striving together to reach our, our fullest artistic potential. For us, the beauty of Bowdoin is the way that everybody collaborates and lifts each other up.